Hi, I'm Laura Lee Waldorf. I'm a natural health consultant and a myotherapist. My contact information is lauraleewaldorf.com or 805-439-0882. I live on the Central Coast in Avila Beach, California, and it's a wonderful place to live. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a potassium broth. And the reason why you want the benefits of the potassium broth is because it flushes out inorganic minerals and other toxins that could be in your system. So it's easy ingredients that you can buy at the grocery store. You want to buy organic because organic has all the minerals and the vitamins in it and doesn't have the pesticides or herbicides on it. So what I'm going to do is show you. Here's this um, board. And what we're going to do is we're going to use 25. We're going to have a large pot. We're going to have potatoes that have been peeled. And then we're going to take the peelings and we're going to take a handful of peelings and we're going to put it in the pot. The next thing we're going to do is carrots. Here we pe peeled the carrots. Here are the carrot peels. I'm going to take a handful and put it in the pot. Next thing that we're going to be doing is beets. Now beets are a natural blood purifier and you want to use the greens also. Isn't this a gorgeous beet? Anyway, we cut some up and so we're just going to go ahead and take a handful and put it in the pot. The next thing that we're going to be doing is celery. Organic celery is wonderful for minerals and potassium. Here we are, a handful of celery that was pre-cut. Put it in the pot. And the next thing that you want is greens, any kind of leafy greens. What I did is I went through the grocery store and I looked for green leafy vegetables. I found cilantro, some chard, some spinach. I found some collard greens, some kale, some parsley, and some more collard greens. Anyway, here it is all chopped up. And what we're going to do is take a handful and put it in the pot. Even another handful. And then here are some peppers. I always use cayenne pepper. It's a circulatory herb. If you can get used to it, get it in your body. So just cut off the top of it and throw it in the pot. Then what I'm going to do is take distilled water. The reason why you want distilled water is because it is empty molecules and any toxins can, as the water runs through your system, any toxins can go into the empty molecules and be pulled out of your system. So I'm just going to put this whole thing of distilled water in here and then put the lid on the pot we're going to bring it over to the stove and we're going to go ahead and we're going to simmer it for one hour or one hour and a half depending on your stove and then what you're going to do is you're going to strain off the vegetables and you're going to drink the broth you can put it in the refrigerator for two to three days and just sip on it as you go throughout the day and, and that way the, um, it can go through your system and it can start getting rid of those things that your body is trying to get rid of on their own, but you're just helping it out. Again, my name is Laura Lee Waldorf. You can get a hold of me at lauraleewaldorf.com. Thank you very much for watching this video. And the next video is going to be on something else that can help you cleanse and nourish your body. Thanks for watching and vitality is so awesome. Come join me. Bye-bye now.